I've been waiting a long time for this. The difference between silicone and SIG's solar panels. And as a bonus, 100 watt portable solar panels. We're only doing 100 watts in this video. I'm gonna test the six panel. Amps, hit this button so it zeroes out. I'm gonna do all the negative, oh shoot, all negative wires. 2.9, can you see this? Whoa, whoa, 3.1. When comparing solar panels, that doesn't tell us anything. Now we wanna know voltage so we can get the watts. I unplugged the wire. There's no wear outside to get this reading. But every time I talk about voltage, I'm switching to that. Amps, I'm going to this amp. It's for AC and this one's for DC. And this is a select reset. There isn't a separate AC and DC voltage. It says AC right there. You hit this button, boom. Switches over to DC. Now you can get your reading. There you go, directly into the panel. Do not cross these. You'll short out your panel. 21.1, 21.2. DC amps, 2.4. Let's try the other one. 2.7, 2.8. I'm glad I tested both of these a little bit better from the same brand. We want the voltage so we can get the total watts. Without both values, it wouldn't be an accurate comparison. Flip this thing over to volts. Make sure I'm not blocking it. 21.1 volts. Try the other panel. Exactly the same, 21.1. So interesting, I just hooked these up in parallel because I was curious, I'm getting 21.8. Well, let's check the portable panel. If you've seen my past videos, you know this thing came from Costco. A little bit of a wire tangle. I have a bunch of MPPTs, that way I can test solar panels. I'm gonna lay it flat, that's how I tested all the others. Check the amps, I'm gonna plug it into the charger. The wires are together, it's not gonna work. Amps, DC, zero it out. If I put it over the wire, nothing happens. You gotta put it over the positive or the negative, so let's see. 2.1. Let's call it 2.2. Let's do the voltage. Put this thing on volts. Push the yellow button to put it on DC. The middle is positive. The outside of the barrel, negative. We're getting 21.38 volts. What the hell? Warm and humid. My solar panel is keeping the rain off my windows. 65 watts is quite a bit more than 59. I wasn't expecting more than a 10% difference. And on a summer day, that's gonna be even more wattage. Subscribe for the next video where I compare the 200 watt SIGS panel to larger silicone panels.